so I would say the iMac in this in the last model bit for comparing it to the last model Alienware the iMac is totally worth it this is this thing is just too overpriced and guys please don't compare this stuff to a PC graphics cards these are meant to be something mobile and something to be uh, to not have to deal with wires to not have to deal with uh, changing motherboard changing CPUs taking a look at your PC what is going on in there and having a massive thing on your desk so uh, don't compare them to a desktop graphics cards and it takes a lot of effort and engineering to have SLI 680M on this kind of laptop on a laptop this is a lot just having two GTX 680 desktop graphics card next to each other will be around this the same size of this laptop so just the graphics cards will be the size of this laptop they could fix they could fit that into this and it's pretty a big big move for alienware i would definitely if i if i had a good uh, high-end desktop or for myself i would definitely go and i had the money i would definitely go buy not this one i would just go for this one because it's more than two two thousand dollars cheaper why should i pay two thousand dollars more for just around 19 to 20 percent increase of graphics performance next i have here a 680mx compared to a 780m so again here is going to be showing you guys this this is this means a lot see it's the new generation this is the old generation but over here this this x saves and here i have oh what is this okay let's <laughs> i think that's it for this video i think i will just go to apple then and show you how how much will it cost you to build something like that you always know that apple products are many people say you're paying for the brand but compared to a alienware laptop you're not at all paying over for an overpriced pc look at this 3.4 gigahertz i just top it up just just to the top okay no i don't want to compare the cpu and stuff let's just bring it down and to just keep this uh, the same as the Alienware's, I will just upgrade this to a uh, 3.9 GHz with Turbo Boost. This thing costs you around half the price, and you get only around where was it? See, you get only around 37% lower. Uh, uh, what do you say? Lower, lower performance. Which I would say, like I would just pay apple one thousand dollars even more just to get a dual graphics cards but again just the, don't if you're going to if you if you're going to keep that on your desk don't uh, just wait some more time just wait till 2014 many pcs and everything is going to be updated till then apple may be going to be releasing a new imac uh, just wait for that maybe finally something will beat the alienware laptop and they are not actually this thing has only a full hd screen full hd is going out now like 4k is in the shops right now you i want a 4k i don't want a 4k display but i want something like 1440p display or 1600p uh, uh, display or something like that I want something like that on my Alienware I don't want Full HD anymore I had Full HD on my old Pavilion laptop what do you say like that one costs me around 1,000, 1,200 
and I had full HD display with 630M graphics card. I know that it's going, it's pretty weak, but I had the top model for that price. And yeah, thank you guys for watching and uh, subscribe to my channel. It's a new channel, so I need some supports. And let, please like this video. Don't dislike it for just a mic because I'm going to change it soon. I promise that to you guys and take care.